glasses back on. <laughs> in fact, I'm going to be in 3D, so look at the monitor, uh, not me. <laughs> now, before we start, uh, we should calibrate the instruments uh, so, that, so that it works properly. And so if I could ask um, us to uh, bring on the electronic calibration system, if you could just look at the bubbles. <laughs> I know this is a cheap trick. Um, is it working for you? <laughs> yes. Uh, thank you very much for that calibration. Uh, unlike, unlike Dan, who grew up in the 60s, uh, I, was, I was born in the 60s. And, um, uh, unlike Dan, uh, who watched Apollo 11, uh, my first encounter was, it was space was, was in fact Star Trek. And, um, and so today we're going to talk a great deal about, about the similarities between uh, Star Trek and the work that we're doing. Uh, this is a conference uh, about developers. In fact, uh, as a first, this is the first conference for GPU developers. Never in the history of the computer industry has there been a developers conference for programming GPUs. And look how large it is. Uh, Dan gave you some statistics, and as you wander the halls, you're going to realize the, the breadth and the excitement of work that's being done on GPUs. All started by CUDA as we kicked out uh, the GPU computing revolution. And so I want to thank all of you for being here. Uh, this is um, a conference about the developers of GPUs, but this is also a conference about the entire ecosystem. For people who are developing content on GPU, or developing applications on GPUs, as well as the people whose uh, work are transformed in some fundamental way uh, by GPUs. And you're going to see examples uh, 